The Top 10 Smartest People Alive Number 10. John Sununu Cuban-born John Sununu was governor of New Hampshire and served as the White House Chief of Staff under President George H. Bush. With an IQ between 176 and 180, Sununu is a member of Mensa and the Mega IQ Societies. They only accept those that are in the 98% and 99.99999% percentile on IQ tests. Number 9. Marilyn Von Savant Entering the countdown at number 9, Marilyn Von Savant was born in 1946 and at one point had the highest IQ in the world at 186. She is known for her popular syndicated column, Ask Marilyn. She's married to the man who invented the artificial heart. Number 8. Grigory Perlman I know how to control the universe. Why would I run to get a million? Tell me. This 49-year-old eccentric Russian genius with an IQ estimated between 180 and 220 has shunned fame and fortune in favor of living at home, taking care of his elderly mother. He accomplished and gave so much to the field of mathematics but he detests the fame that goes with it, and today he has stated that talking about math makes him sick. Number 7. Jacob Barnett When Jacob Barnett was born in 1998, he was diagnosed with Asperger's, and his parents were told he would never be able to talk or walk. At age 3, he suddenly started speaking and was reciting the alphabet backwards and explaining the laws of planetary orbit. Showing off his 189 IQ, you can catch Jacob on his YouTube channel where he explains quantum mechanics. Number 6. Gary Kasparov Gary Kasparov is one of the greatest chess players in history. He was 17 when he became a grandmaster and 20 when he won the world championships. Kasparov retired from chess in 2003. Kasparov is reported to have an IQ between 180 and Number 5. Philip Imiguali Philip Imiguali has an unconfirmed IQ of 190. He dropped out of school to fight for his country in the Nigerian Biafran War. He has several master's degrees in mathematics and engineering. Number 4. Christopher Langan With an IQ of 195, Christopher Langan is dubbed the smartest man in the U.S., and he is a college dropout. He dropped out of Montana State University after feeling like he was smarter than his professors and wasn't learning anything. He is most recognized for his theory, Cognitive Theoretic Model of the Universe. Number 3. Kim Ung Yong Cracking the top three, Kim Ung Yong was born in South Korea. He was fluent in four languages by age two, hired by NASA at age eight after finishing college at age 5. Ung Yong is the definition of child prodigy. According to the Guinness Book of World Records, his IQ is 210. Number 2. Christopher Harada Born in 1982, Christopher Harada started working for NASA at the age of 16. After he graduated from the California Institute of Technology with a bachelor's degree in physics, not surprising with an IQ of 225. Hirata researched the feasibility of humans living on Mars. He is presently a professor at Ohio State University and holds several degrees, including a PhD from Princeton University. Number 1. The smartest person alive with a verified IQ of 230 is Terence Tao. Tao was enrolled in university mathematics courses at the age of 9, while subsequently teaching calculus at Garfield High School. He earned a bachelor's, master's, and doctorate by the time he was 20 years old. He has earned dozens of awards, including the Distinguished Fields Medal, 2006, and was named Fellow of the Royal Society, 2007. Tao is presently teaching math courses at UCLA and has published over 250 research papers. Time for the question of the day. If you were the smartest person in the world, what would your ultimate goal in life be? Would it be to solve world hunger, to discover life on other planets, or simply become the richest man alive? 
let us know by leaving your comments down below. And as usual, thanks for watching. If you're not already subscribed, go ahead and click that subscribe button to see more awesome top 10 clips. We come out with top 10 videos just for you every week. Yes, you. Be sure to give this clip a thumbs up and go ahead and check out one of our other top 10 videos you see on the screen now.